A former mayor of a town in Lackawanna County has taken it upon himself to preserve a lot of the town's history. 2822 News reporter Catherine O'Leary took a visit to German to learn more of its importance. Preserving the past and honoring those before us. That's the goal for former German mayor Bruce Smolikom. Because they're not teaching local history in schools. They teach national history and world history, but they don't teach anything local. So the only way people are going to know local history is if we preserve it. For the past three years, Smolikom has been renovating an old building as the official German historical site, even restoring the building's original ceiling. It was a Welsh church in 1884 to 1913 and it was perfect to become a museum. With plans to fill the walls with memorabilia like old German high school diplomas and birth certificates, Smolikom also wants to tell the story some residents might not know, such as the beginning of first aid, which started by miners right here in German. And then they met with Dr. Matthew Shields, who lived in German and was our town doctor, and then they got together and formed the first aid team. They did bandaging and Dr. Shields came and seen what they were doing at the mines. And when he got there, people were already dressed with their wounds were dressed and they were taken care of and he couldn't get over it. So he moved on farther with it. And then the uh, Red Cross picked it up and carried it all across the country. Along with the stories, there will be displays of original artifacts and tools used by miners back in the day. So this plunger would have been made for blowing up the holes in the, in the coal vein so that they could dig out coal. Reporting in German, Catherine O'Leary, 2822 News. There is no definite date on when the historical building will open, but Smolikum hopes it's going to be during the summer. He says volunteers are always welcome and needed, and you can find his info on our website. That's pahomepage.com if you want to get involved.